everyone, it's Victory Equine. Welcome back to today's episode. Today we're gonna be talking about how to give your horse a show cut. So Pride's gonna be my lovely model here today. As you can tell, we have quite the mane to work with. So it's gonna be a pretty big drastic change. So without further ado, let's hop to the video. Okay guys, so we're gonna start with the items you're gonna to wanna to have on hand for your show cut. So. Uh, we're first going to start with just giving Pride a whole bath because he's pretty dirty. We want the mane and tail to be clean before we start cutting because otherwise if it's matted and tangled or dirty, it's not going to be completely straight and how it would set if he's show ready. So I'm going to start today with a shampoo called Gallup Color. It's by Carr and Day and Martin. Um, it's a darkening shampoo. Pride bleaches really bad in the summer. So I've been trying to just keep him um, darker by preventing bleaching. You are then going to want to have your fly spray on hand. This will just keep your horse calm and if it's summertime you don't want him stomping and messing you up as you cut. Now after you shampoo then we're going to go ahead and add some show sheen. So show sheen is great because it just leaks down the hair. It's a nice polish um, and detangler so um, it's just going to help everything look better and we can really see how we want it to look by the end and just really is great at conditioning the hair as well. Okay, then of course we can't forget the essentials. So we're going to need a hairbrush. This is going to help us get all the tangles out after we've put the show sheen in. A comb just to make sure everything's straight and even. And then lastly but not leastly, your scissors. So make sure you have sharp scissors if you want to test it on just the edges first. I would definitely advise doing so so you're not getting there and trying to take a chop and it's not doing its job. All right, let's give this horse a bath. a beautifully washed and clean horse. We're just gonna let him dry a few minutes to prevent the hair from breaking if we go to brush it while it's still wet. So we're just gonna, it's okay to do it damp, but we're gonna give it a few minutes to just settle and dry a bit. is ready to go. We sprayed him with the show sheet. We are ready to start cutting. So what you want to have on hand now is your scissors and your comb. Uh, if you have a tall horse like me, you might want to also have a step ladder. I am going to start at the top and work my way down. So just combing him out one more time, just making sure everything looks good. Okay, okay he has a couple knots up here. Kind of nervous. I haven't cut his hair in years. Okay, so we are just gonna go for it here. So. This is our first cut. As you can tell, it's pretty jagged, pretty rough. 
Uh, we're gonna go back in, straighten it. We're also gonna bring it up a little bit. I want it to be a little shorter than what I have it. I just wanted to get the main edges off. And we're gonna take it up another inch or two, so. All right, here we go. Oh my word, he's looking dorky. He scissors, as I told you, make sure your scissors are short. I do not heed my own words. And these are pretty dull, and I'm doing a very choppy and poor job. The good news is hair does grow back. So we're just gonna keep going and um, hope it looks better in a month. Look at all that hair. Oh my goodness. We cut so much off. Yeah. Oh boy. You're a dork. You're a dork. Boing, boing. Hello. You're so cute. All right, so here's our semi-finished project. I think I'm maybe not the best person to ask how to trim horse's hair. Yeah, bud. Um, so I ended up having to go pretty short here because my scissors were very dull. And so it's, he looks a bit dorky. Yeah, see he agrees. He's not super happy about his new haircut. Um, but yeah, as I said, the good news is it grows back. Uh, I'm a little bit sad about how it turned out. I think I'm gonna come back tomorrow and just fix it up a little bit with a better pair of scissors. So, yeah. Yeah, is that what you have to say about it? It just makes you young. Oh, I agree. I am tired after that haircut. It was quite the battle with those scissors to just get them to cut anything. So, um, I'm sorry for the less than um, informational video, but that's it for today. So thanks for following us on our horrific haircut. So see you all next time. Hopefully our video will be more inspiring and helpful to you. But at least I hope you found some good humor. <laughs> I think pride agrees. All right, bye everyone. Thank you for joining.